Yo, 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 what up, YouTube? Be actors, your boy Daddy Easy here, aka Crash Over, otherwise known as iPod Jawbreak Hacker. And as you can see, my audio quality is very good, it's way better, and it's more professional now instead of recording through the microphone through the computer. I am using a Turtle Beach X11s, so all the audio quality will be perfect better on. I got other headsets that I use with a PC, so y'all don't have to worry about y'all can't hear me, y'all don't have to worry about bad quality audio. Everything is better. So basically this video right here is for people that updated to iLife 11, 2011, and having problems with some of the programs like iPhoto. Now, I currently just upgraded from iLife 09, and when I upgraded, I wasn't able to open up my iPhoto. So basically what you need, you need to do this before you do anything. You need to go to a website, which I will put in the description. You need to go to apple.com. So in the description, I'm going to highlight it right here. As you can see right here, you need to go to support.apple.com slash KB slash DL1322, which is going to bring you here, <clears throat> which I will put the link in the description for y'all so y'all can get it straight here. Only thing I need to do is download. So <clears throat> if you didn't upgrade it from the main thing, and basically if you have iPhoto 09 and you upgrade it, to 11 and you forgot to upgrade it you forgot to download this add-on right here don't worry just install your iLife run this add-on follow instructions and you're good to go same thing happened with me and I'm gonna show you basically right now that my iPhoto is working so let me just open up applications for you um, scroll down to iPhoto uh, most likely here it is right here let me drop it inside my dock real quick. I'm going to minimize this. And we're going to open it up right now. <clears throat> oh, I will be doing gameplays for the PlayStation 3 now. I just recently got Call of Duty Black Ops for the PS3, Spider Man Shattered Dimensions. So I will be doing gameplays on it. I found myself actually being able to play Black Ops better on the ps3 then on xbox 360 it's due to this, i have bigger hands and i'm able to move around quicker on the ps3 than i am on xbox 360 y'all know the 360 controllers is big as hell so okay as you can see i thought it was working let y'all know this is 11 let's go to about and as you can see i thought of 11 and i am running on the update software for Apple is 10.6.6, I believe. Yeah, 10.6.6, .6, as you can see right there. And see that I purchased this legit. We're going to go to the App Store <clears throat> to show that it is purchased. <clears throat> so just bear with me for a few. Um, I never shut down my computer for I had it open for almost five days. So it might be running a little bit slow due to that. But other than that, my computer is really fast. Okay. See, I got iMovie installed. Here it is, iPhoto. Click on it, install. <clears throat> and basically, it's purchased. So if y'all having problems with your iPhoto, y'all need help, just go to my description. I'll put the link in the description for all y'all so y'all can actually get it. And I'll catch you guys later. Tell me how y'all like my new intro. It's your boy Daddy Easy, aka Crash Over, otherwise known as iPod Jailbreak Hacker. And I'll catch you guys later in my next video. Peace. Later, dudes.